emotional damage. <laughs> T-Rex time! Fun fun! Good job, Arcane. <laughs> no, I'm back. What's up? <laughs> we just got T-Rex man and Zed tried to copy it. <laughs> man. Down. I'm sorry. Sorry. I mean, the crap out of Wolf. Holy Wolf, where are you? For him, we can uh, let's see what the few times like. Hey, where are you guys? Yeah. Uh, where the cool guys are. So you're still in Holbrack from the last event, is what I'm hearing. Oh, I was talking about. <laughs> it's 100 where you are. Well, yeah. Texas, I'm from Texas. 
cheated and poured it right on top of him. <laughs> okay, let's see where there's a Dorito at. Oh shit, no wait, I need to pick up some stuff. Have any plans? Hello, traveler. Nope, I gave them all to Wade. Cause those are for the maps, those are not for... Oh, wait, wait, what? Yeah, she's here. Oh, she's right here. But I am going to go to the guild hall and get the guild hall bu uh, buff for World Blue World. If you guys want to get it, you can. Spend some coin. Guild. Board reward track boost. Take it. Oh wow, eight percent. That's not bad. Until next time. You said go to the guild hall. Yeah, down here in the bar. Get a drink. There's a bar at the guild hall now. There's a bar at the guild hall. <sighs> well, it's an entire in room. This dude right here. Always happy to see customers. You won't let me in! Because your mouth's too big! You won't let me in! You can only use one at a time, though. We almost have all of his upgrades done. Oh, that's why I haven't done this one yet. Because it costs one super uh, boom box. Bro. <laughs> Track. Okay, going to be all pretty low. <laughs> oh yeah, our jumping puzzle's still here. <laughs> I haven't fixed it. <laughs> okay, let's see here. Oh, Evie must have a Dorito. There's one in queue. Go to Evie for now. Oh shit, that's a lie, I insta queued. I'm an EB. You tricked us. Ah, uh, yes. They were, oh my god, there is something going on. Look at all those trebuchets on the map. Oh, there's a Dorito attacking the keep! I'm on my way! Which one again? EB. Eternal Battlegrounds. Are you sure? 
Yeah, there's an orange Dorito attacking the keep right now. Are you sure? Fucking bite me. <laughs> but are you sure? Find out for yourself, fool. I'm running through the fort. Oh god, they're running around the outside edge. Hex, where are you? Woo! Shit! I asked if you joined up, but now yeah, I gotta get used to push the talk again. Ah! I don't know which wall is down. I'm on my way. I don't know, but that guard saw me. Fuck this. There's the wall that's down, it's over here. Fuck that noise, I'm running. Shake it off. You poisoned. My adrenaline is rising. Need a Oh shit! You guys left me alone! Damn it. Are we, are we backing off? I'm already wrecked. Oh, he's a PV, like he's a PVP player. He's dragon rank. I just got dragon stomped. You guys could do it though. I believe in you. Kill his pet. Yes. Kiting you into the into the bosses in there. Oh, a noble soul is rezzing me. Not anymore. He's not. He's also shooting the legendary bow at you guys. Oh, oh there's another blue coming out. Yeah, I know that there's a warrior there with you now. Okay. I think the orange tag died too. Or he, not, yeah, he did. Go back to the orange tag. Got some supplies. Oh, it's an improved supply camp.
The fun is over. Did he? Did they really give up? Did that Dorito quit? Yeah, he stopped. Yeah, he's not being with Commander. Okay, we're gonna go to a different map then. We're gonna go roam a different map. EB is not fun right now. Hey, Dark Haven's got some things we can steal. Go in there. Okay. We're gonna go camping. on that camp that's our camp already that one's contested that one's free up top we can run to the top one oh and there's a sentry right there Let's do it. Where did he go? He's a thief. He's getting the fuck out of there. No, he's a hunter. Okay, that's where we're going. We're going to that sentry anyways. Hills, though. Unicorn stomping his ass! Motherfucker. <laughs> it's like it's kind of done, but okay. No, he was trying to rally off me. Interrupting me, that fucker. Oh, uh, we want the low ground.
Go take out that sentry. There's a bunch of greens on me. There's a whole team of greens. I see it, I'm coming back! Yeah, she, <laughs> she left us to die. <laughs> they kind of just ran with me for a while. I don't know why. I got the unicorn. I think he was mad at me. I love that Final Fantasy maintenance night. Right? I'm gonna take the blue camp to the left. It's on off cooldown now. So where's Wolf? I don't know where Wolf is! He's not answering me! Well, now the title makes much less sense if it's making fun of him. Well, no, it's making fun of ourselves, too, because, you know, we're, we're babbies at this. Well, that's nowhere near as much fun as just making fun of him. But we need him here, I know! Damn. Where's Wade? Probably sleeping. It's still early for him. Don't worry, I'll message him. Need my Ozzy husby. Ozzy husband, save me! Oh, hey, did we yeah. fucking miss it? I got it. Wow, <laughs> motherfucker! Oh, there's another green over there. Or a red. Or a teammate, I think. A uh, green dot. There's a blue There's right a blue. here. Two blue? There's just like one. He's fighting running. a war. Let's just chase him. Let's find out where he goes. Let's see if it murders us or not. I think he's going against a wall right now. So. Oh, he just tried to blink. Is this like a thief ability? Or he left the arena area? He left World v. World said, fuck this, I'm gone. Okay. Okay, let's go back this way then. Oh, because that's their spawning zone. Probably ported. Go take I need that this. blue camp. I need okay. this. Okay, I okay, come back, come back, come back. I'm good. Yep. Giving this warg a run for its money. He's leading him in circles. What women do best, right? Oh, here he is! Hi, buddy! Is that the same one? Yeah, it is! He's running! Oh, that's his spawn point. Leave him alone. Leave him alone. That's his spawn point. There's another one there. Yeah, there's, that's what I said. It's his spawn point. Run. See if they follow. Oh, nope, but that's one of ours. With some green. They just left their machines with me. There's an engineer there. Uh. Hello, Terex. How are you doing? I'm dying like the best of them. <laughs> it's like green is very heavily on this map after all.
congrats, dude. We see some here. Hold on. How much supply did you guys pick up? I have 20. Oh, I see something over there. Green. Two more greens. Can. Yep, run, run back to the spawn. Yeah, this this map right is oh, I'm good at running away. Next Yeah, let me check the other maps. Need at least one more person to make some of this stuff work. Go to Sanctum of Rawl. If not, we can do Edge of Mist running instead of uh, this area. It'll get us the same kind of a uh, pointage. is under attack. It is. Knock knock on the door. Jump in there. It's wolf. There he is. What's going on? Did you guys Wait. switch? I said we went to Sanctum of Raw. Were you not listening? Oh my god. You're going <laughs> yeah. Oh, hey, look, more green. Oh my <laughs> god, indeed. It's green night. Seriously. They, they noticed that you were streaming and they were like, we gotta get in there. <laughs> That's stream snipe. Stream snipe this, this person. I don't have my stream information in those kits, though. So your your uh, hat just sits. Like, nope, I'm done. Cat don't care. I it's mean... Cat. 
we're not facing uh, bots that are dueling. Oh, and there's one oh, right there. Where? To the right of the vista, which I don't have actually. I don't have it either, but I'm not going for it. Oh, go for it! And there's a there's a green. There's go two for green. it! There's three greens. <laughs> and there's one of ours that. Yeah, and he just nuked him down like it was nothing. I'm on my way! Yeah, he did! Death oh, the boring one! I could tag up, we have people here now. He still got five minutes left, what are we doing here? He was just taken, that's the problem. Oh, that green took him, I see. Yeah. There's a green over there. The green. <laughs> he turned and ran. There's another one coming. There's another one coming. Oh, behind us too. That's when we just mark. Did the text go? Here he comes. Well, that was a lot of damage. Yeah. are following us. The tarnish coast, tarnish coast border. One up top for a moment here. Going to our own area. Yeah. Wolf, you're online, yeah. I'm doing my dailies. In Guild Wars. Yeah. You're doing your dailies in World v World, right? Uh, no. <laughs> you're gonna come with us. I'll join your party. Come play in World War for a little bit. You need to try it, because it's just like Adventure Box, you'll get addicted. And you don't need a cat to be in here. And also, you don't have to have a raptor either to unlock the cat. That's what told me I do. Nope. We looked it up. You just have to have a, a Path of Fire, which you do. And then when you get into Rover World, you just have to put your point, one point, in one of the tracks in there, and it unlocks it. Um, I thought you had to get a mastery point when I was like, I don't have the mastery to unlock. 
Nope, nope. Uh, World so World has their own point system. World be World Mastery. Yeah. Let's see here. Since our borderland got going on. We could go down to that camp down there. There's a bunch of Doliacs so we can slap. Just and oh. So you want to come run with us, or when you're done with your dailies? I don't know what I'm doing. Well, we will show you. That's why we would do this. Hell, I'll even do it on foot with you. No, that's fine. Where is the auction now? There we go. Because the other thing too is, as long as you are in a party of people that have their points in the cat zone, uh, you get the same run speed as the mount, so you don't need the mount. But what you need to do is you, uh, if you haven't changed your keybind, press B. Pull up the World v. World uh, map. D, V, or T, which one did you just say? B, as in boy. Bravo. Oh, there's a tag! Perfect! That's a Zerg. And then you want to click on the Tarnish Coast Borderlands. Queue up for that. Okay. Keep an eye on that tag, uh, text. Uh... Um, okay, B, and Tarnish Coast. Yep, yep. Desert. Yep, yep. Okay. Oh yeah, they're going for that blue camp. Oh shit, because there's a, there's a green right there that just took our camp in front of us. Yep. Welcome, Wolf. Now, it, now when you, once you load in, let me know. I'm here. Okay, you want to hit uh, B again, and down at the bottom it'll say rank and abilities. Okay. On the rank and abilities thing, um, I think you have one point or two, I can't remember. Or maybe one, I don't know. Well, down at the very bottom it says Warclaw Mastery, you just put one point in. Unlock it. Okay, I got it. Okay, now that you've put that one point in, it unlocks the collect uh, the collection uh, achievement to start gathering the parts of your war claw. You you have to assemble it. <laughs> uh, war claw, uh, acquire war claw emblem by spending one point. I'll get an emblem. Yep. World v world war claw. Complete the task to earn a war claw mount. Capture a keep, capture a camp, capture a tower, etc. Yep. Yep. That's right. Do okay. you have any more points left to spend by any chance? Nope. Okay, so when you get more points, recommendation is to put at least one in gliding. <laughs> so you can glide in your zones. And then I would also recommend... Uh, putting your points into the Provision Master up to the 20 point marker so you can auto-loot your bodies. <laughs> Meaning it'll pick up for you instead of you having to pick up your loot. Okay. You'll also need to change your reward track to the one that the achievement should have unlocked for you. I don't know how to do that. So hit B again. Yeah. And then right next to it, it'll say reward track. And you scroll down okay. until you find the one that says war claw, mastery, or whatnot, and click activate. Are these like repeatable tracks? Mm. Yes. Some of some of them are. There's like the a million of them. Yeah. Some you can only do once. Some are repeatable. So like as long one. as it shows at the top, that means it's my active one. Correct. Yes. Okay. And then on top of that, um, this is also where you'll come to get the 
um, gift of battle for if you ever want to build legendaries. Only get it in here doing this. Yeah, I think that was what I had currently selected, but I don't know. Awesome, so now that you have that, let me see where that Dorito is. Well, the good thing is switching between tracks doesn't reset progress. So like, this is 0 out of 40, do I have to get 20,000 40 times? No. No, the 0 out of 40, I believe, is uh... It's like every 500 or so is like a stopping point. Yeah, you get like a reward, yeah. So 20,000 is the entire bar? Correct. Yeah. Okay. Okay, hey, well if we're gonna start... Stay with us so that you can get our Warclaw run speed. Um, because they are taking a, a keep and that's something you need. Okay. No, they're not taking a keep, they're defending a keep. But... Oh, they're defending it? Wait, let me see it on here. Oh, yeah. they are defending it. So, let's follow the green ones that are running. To the west? Yes, follow these guys. Okay. And you'll probably want to stay near Silva. She's the only one of us that has the no. boost. Uh, Texas has it too. No, I don't. No, he doesn't. It, it takes 15 points and he's only level 12. Um, okay. I'm one point away from getting it. Unless I respect for it. But if he's near any of these other war cats that have it, he'll still get it. Yeah, but we don't know if they have it or not. Alright, I'm just fine. <gasps> Doliak, I want it! Nope. Damn it! They're spawning though! Let's go kill them! I'm obsessed with the Doliaks because I want the Doliak slapper title. Is this above us? Yep, it's above us. to gain five tokens. Okay, sure, why not? Claim, claim for... No? Yes? No? I, I, what, I don't know. What? what was it? I'm sorry, what was your question? Uh, 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 no, I, I just see something on the left side of my screen that says claim for Aeon. Oh, that's for guilds. So I already... Uh, since we have enough people in our guild here representing while we're role-playing, we had a higher contribution rate to this, so we got picked first to claim this, and if we had World We World buffs running in our guild, we would get those buffs from Going to the camp. tower to the left. Okay, then let's go. Where the commander's going. The left? Okay. Went to the oh, left again. I, <laughs> 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 I, I, I forgot I didn't have, um... Uh, Glidey. Glider. <laughs> yeah, I just gonna, <laughs> I just gonna <laughs> jump off. <laughs> Oops. Yeah, that'll happen a lot. Oh, by the way, in World of Worlds, you can't glide in a zone that you don't own. So if you're in an enemy territory and you jump off to glide, you will die. <laughs> yeah, the mastery just unlocks gliding in your area. Looks like they busted through the first wall already. Okay. Oh, I see it in map chat. Wall down. Can't run through that. It's green. <laughs> we are I don't red. Know what that means we are we're a red team. So anything that's red is our property. So if it's okay. got a red door, you can run through it. If it's got a different color door, you're kind of fucked. I, the only doors that I know are within dry top. <laughs> or the silver okay. waste. Those in the we're waiting for it to come off buff soon. Okay. So if you oh, see yeah, above this, if you see on this guy's head here, this big giant green Dorito. That means he's leading a zerg. If you stick with those people, usually you get shit done, especially since you need this for your achievement. Need what? The claiming of this for a war claw part. Oh, okay. oh, gotcha. 
Yeah, the war claw achievement. So just find guy just has you doing like different world, world stuff. So just find a guy with the with the green shit and then just follow him. Or whatever color it is, just that icon in general, which you can see on any of the maps in the world. Uh, I thought you said we're red. Why does he have a green one? Because he chose to have a green colored marker. You can change the color of oh, it. Okay. Gotcha. It can also look more cat-like instead of a Dorito. Off the cash shop? No. <laughs> you actually, uh, it's a hundred gold. Get it collected from cats. There's a champion person there. Yeah, that's the boss that we're waiting for the debuff to come off of because we can't touch him right now. now and we can... oh, kill okay. it! It's so you can't spam, you know, capture back and forth. Things go and pull down. Mm -hmm. So, this is like kind of taking a mine in Alteric Valley. Kind there's of. a commander, you kill the commander, and you take you take the mine. Uh, that was actually a good it's, it's kind of, kind of like an alter valley. I don't mean the whole. I don't mean the whole warfront. I mean just the mine portion of it. Then there are chests of, that the. Yeah, uh, one appeared next right next to me. I just looted it. Oh, cool! I got a thing. Can I, do I click claim for myth? Do I click it or do I ignore this? Mm, I'm, I'm gonna ignore So what that does is like, you can, as a guild, put up buffs for World v. World. And if you claim it, it's the guild's buffs. So since we don't really have those buffs running. It's not very fair to create. take it from a World v. World guild that might need those buffs. Ah, uh, so you like, cause we don't have anything running. We don't have anything we can give. Correct. Correct. Gotcha. Um, there he is. Yeah, the thing too is, uh... Um, you taking the middle? Like it. Wait, where's Wolf? I'm following the, um, green dude. Well, that's good. I just wanted to make sure I'm there so you can get the, bo the boost. Oh, I just leveled up so I can also get the boost. Nice, Krat. Fifteen more points I don't put into anything useful most of the time. So <laughs> you should ex explain the uh, the pip above his map and stuff like that. Oh so yeah, yeah. That. So above your mini map, there's a like a progression bar for how much uh, work you put into doing things in World of Yeah, yeah. I, I, I'm used to that from uh, Heart of Thorns. I've, I'm familiar with that. Okay, so pipping out means after you're done, if you're done doing activities for World of World for the day. You literally want to go sit in the base and wait until that timer exits out because you get points as it counts down. Yeah. And that'll yeah, go you know, towards. Yeah, I, I, I'm familiar the, with that aspect. It'll go towards your ranking track. Yeah, the idea is that you 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 engage in activities, you build the bar, you get bonus, you get extra awards at the end of the cycle, like well, like day night cycles in uh, Tangled Brush or whatever it is, or yep. Bird and Brink. Yeah. Okay. Ah, uh, sure. Next reward for me is two strong boxes, I guess. This, uh, World v. World gives you a lot of stuff. It gives you a lot of money, a lot of loot, a lot of things. Well, if it, if it didn't, I would fucking think this would be abandoned content, right? They have to, like, incentivize you doing otherwise. No one this would do it. Content. Yeah. <laughs> for most people, this is, this this is what, what they do. Yeah, this is what they do. Well, aside from, like, you know, chilling out and just capturing Shit. bases, it's pretty... Not a lot going on. Is there a guy in here? Oh there's my god, there's a team! Yeah. Like, do you get... Do I get, like, bonus things by shooting these guys? Or do I just be in the area and I get stuff? Uh, killing them does get you more points and more goodies, because every time you kill them, uh, you also get a currency from... Alright, I got one. But those are NPCs. Those are real people we're killing right now. You see the, the the green arrows on their head are real people. For real, they just like stood there and got wrecked. <laughs> yep. They were like they were like bots. Yep. Well, we kind of zerged on them, so they, they kind of ran. <laughs> oh, okay, they they were all like evenly spread out, so I thought they were like just like you know AI just set up to be like a line. Nope. There there can be. We found some bots yesterday that were kind of doing that. But... Yeah, just like in WoW, people will have bots running their characters, so... 
But that doesn't change that it's an actual like account. Also, you want to keep an eye on your map chat because that's it's sometimes one one. where uh, the uh, leaders will put like right there. Yeah, we're gonna go to the. Let's repair the wall. Yep. Because we're defending our stuff. Yeah, so there's also like barrels, if you look at the very top, called supply in each of the camps, uh, like supply that you can grab. I, and they, I, they build, I don't, I don't yeah. know. I don't know what's going on. We'll, I'm like, we'll, sh we'll show you every, where the supply stuff is. Something said, let's repair a wall, and then everyone ran away. Yeah, the, the wall was it, Like, if you click on the wall, it'll show a percent. Like, it has its own health bar and percentage. And so you can spend that, like what Texas is talking about, the barrel icon at the top of your HUD. Next to the the time timers and, the... and everything like that. Yeah, I got ten. I got ten barrel. So you've got right. ten supply. Right. Okay. So you can repair walls in our in the areas that we control if they're or, damaged, or, or you, you can, can use help the supplies to build like catapults or trebuchets while we're trying to steal oh, or break down the walls. Oh, it's a blue. Yeah, we were kind of zerging on the blue. <laughs> Get distracted by the blue, but yeah. So, so like, there are veteran it, scouts and stuff that are but, uh, just NPCs. So if it doesn't have a, if it doesn't have a like a little uh, Dorito, it's an NPC. Correct. Okay. There's three different types of icons to look for. The giant Dorito-looking thing that that guy has, he's a leader. If it has little uh, little arrows above their heads that are either green, blue, or red, like if since we're red, the other opposing teams are going to be green and blue. Those are actual players. You just get assigned a random color? Uh, when they redo yes. the map, yes. The map's reset weekly. Do you get assigned a permanent color for the week? Yes. So, like, your server is a, a always red. green for the week? Yes, so for this week we are red. Uh -huh. Okay. So over here, you see the supply depot that people are picking up stuff at. One corner. If it's an upgraded supply barrel, you'll be able to carry up to 20 resources. If it's not upgraded, you'll most you'll get is 10 um, or 15. And people can spend their resources or their points to upgrade like camps and stuff like that to make it harder for people to take. Five pip, five pips earned for tick. I don't know what that means. So that means for every minute, for every tick, you get five pips towards your achievements. Okay, so there's like a bar that you it's need like to fill? A, it's like a currency, so... Um, if you hit B on the Pro V War map again. Then you go to max uh, match over overview. Here. There's that chest, so you get bronze chest, it goes all the way up like plat and stuff like that. Reward one pips. of four. So once you gather all four rewards, you'll go up to the next tier of rewards chests. Oh, okay. And that resets weekly, those chest things. So it's like your battle, your sort of season pass, even though it's not really a season. Weekly battle pass. Yeah. So you so may see people build camp. stuff. Yep. So now you can help build if you picked up supply. And um, you try not to get into the things you build unless you have the mastery for them, because those with mastery have higher abilities to do more damage. But if it's just like if you're just roaming and there's like just the four of us and we weren't in a zerg like this, it doesn't matter who gets into it because anyone can use it. The higher your mastery points are in a certain uh, expertise, the more damage and better you do. This green door, right? Is is me shooting this door basically just fucking doing nothing? No, yep. you're doing a little bit of damage, like one to two points, but. But is it like almost like it's not worth it compared to the siege weapons? Yes. Yeah. All right, fuck it. You you're better off uh, just sitting around waiting and taking out people that might come in to kill your siege weapons. Or. Oh my god, that's a zerg of green right there. Or, yeah, there's a zerg of green over here. Or using your supplies to help build the uh, trebuchets and stuff. Yeah. Or scouting around, killing the NPCs and other players. I feel like 
it, this would be better if I actually had one of the other two uh, professions. No, Thief's really fucking good here. Well, yeah, but like I. Oh, walls open. Yeah, it really depends. Like, I can't really do anything without like throwing myself into danger, and because I don't have any gear and it's all DPS gear, I'm just gonna get destroyed in seconds. That's all I've got. It's just DPS so gear. like. Uh, yeah, but like you, you're a ranged class. I'm. I have to go into melee. I'm a warrior. I'm melee. I'm double. Oh, you're a warrior now. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, there's a you. You have a point though. Like thief is good in world and world, but it, you're most of the time. Most classes have different builds for PvP and. It just seems like I like if I'm walking with a bunch of people, I should play a ranged class because oh by playing play a. Dead I don't have the points to play it or oh, the gotcha. gear. I, I literally only have one spec unlocked in this game. Well, that's fine, but but this can help you unlock that. That's what's cool about yep. this, because you'll get. Um, no, it's it's fine. It's just like I was just like I I like I was looking. I'm looking at like ten enemies, and I'm going, well, I can't fucking do anything. I'm just gonna get destroyed if I even walk forward. Here they come too. But yeah, uh, you can. Some of the currency you get just from like, participating in World of World. Uh, you'll be able to buy the like, talent book things, basically, and you can just unlock uh, other classes or specs. Wait, fighting oh, green oh, here, oh, Nothing's more satisfying than ah, <laughs> Emblem of the Avenger. I got it. Like, what was the mm -hmm. what 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 was the point of those five green people walking into a bunch of? Like they were gonna people. try to steal the. They were gonna try to defend their keep by keeping us from killing the boss, but the boss was dead by the time they came up there, so they just became fodder to us. Yeah, but like, I, I, I just, from I don't know. I'm just like I'm confused as, the, as to the tactical impl implications <laughs> of five people walking into forty. Like, what did they think was going to happen? <laughs> is my question. Like, like in, in in no strategy would you ever do that. So I was trying to think. Was there like some clue I just didn't? I wasn't aware of. Take your military brain out of this and just realize they were dumb. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. My bad. <laughs> no, that's what I'm saying is that it was a dumb choice is really what it boiled down to. And that's why it was funny for everybody. Moving down to the drawbridge. Drawbridge? Okay. Mm, or my knees. <laughs> Did you say my knees? Yeah, I don't have my glider. Oh, they're going that oh. way. Oh, my knees again. Oh, your face! I saw that! That uh, blue is dead. <laughs> Yeah, as soon as you hit level four, you'll be able to get gliding because the first one is only three points, and you should probably get gliding next, honestly. Mm -hmm. Holy axe. One of these days I'll get that title. One of these days. Oh, I leveled up. I'm 88 now. How do you know when you're done with World Be World? When you feel like you're done being here? Oh, it's just a re constantly repeatable, just do whatever. Yep, yep it's a place okay. where you get to run around and fuck around and not give a damn. Yeah, that's kind of the whole point. Like, there's not really a level cap. It's kind of like Ember. Ashran, but without much fighting. On uh, World v. World on reset days, then that's a different story. Wait, where are you? No, oh, okay. Also, it depends on what time of day, because the Austra or like on the Australian server for World v. World. Well, I'm getting some of these. Where's the meta for this again? I don't remember. Oh, it's under War Claw. There we go. Where's the meta? Uh, you need to kill a guard. Unlock a War Claw helmet by completing a. Oh god, I gotta, I gotta do the War Track. I don't know if I have a purchasing it with a skirmish ticket. Use badges of armor. To, so I have to go. To, I gotta buy some of this shit. Oh, I also have to loot from a guard. Yeah, we gotta so kill a guard for you. Capture, keep, loot a guard. Uh. 
and then buy some shit from a vendor, I guess. I don't know. So, can I just not do anything here? I just have to sit here and watch? Yeah. You can help build if you have supply. Well, what do you mean if you have supply? So I, I have 10 supplies. So, they just go up there, click Oh, they're already built. But yeah, you can technically go up and build them. Can offer supply to help build how, construction. How do I get more supply? When you go to a supply depot that we own, you just walk up to it and click F and you pick it up. And what's the cap? A 20 is the cap. I believe there's also, isn't there a mastery to get a hold a bit more? Yeah, I think so, but I didn't have that, so I wouldn't know. Meow meow! Oh, someone put up yep. a barrier. Yep, there it is. Supply capacity increased to the supply you can carry. So you can maximum would be 25 then, because it, uh... Wall's only... down already, damn! There's five levels of the supply mastery, so... Oh, we're in Wolf, by the way. Let's see yeah. Standing back there. Uh, I'm, I'm reading, uh, okay. cool tips to get an idea. I, I, I don't know what I'm doing, I'm just kind of following. That's what I always do. Oh god, our commander said break time. Oh, bathroom break. He's just gonna chill here for a moment. Okay. It gives you time to read for a little bit. <laughs> what color are we again? Red. Red. Hello, hello, everyone who joined! There's four battlegrounds going on simultaneously? Yep, you can jump between maps. So what do you get when you, like, control the whole map? Uh, you would be the first in history to control everything. <laughs> but like, is this just like a round robin thing? Like they take a, uh, an area, we take an area, and then everyone just gets rewards? Or like, like what's the point of controlling more territory, I guess? The point of and controlling not just more territory is for those people that are like heavily into World of World at the end of the week, you know, they get more uh, rewards. You get more rewards by controlling more territory, but doesn't territory like constantly go back and forth? How do you how do you how do you end with more territory? You have to be in world and constantly be fighting for it. But I mean, I, I like like we just we just took a zone, right? We we, we just took this area, right? This zone, yeah. Is it, is is it is it like is it based on the amount of total zones taken over the week by a terror by a, a faction or something? Ah, uh, da da da. da. Those are answers that I wish Wade was here for because I don't have the proper answers for those. That's well, fine. That's... If you hit, if you hit, open your world world menu and just go to the very front page, you know, Mist War, yeah, where it has the pie chart showing how we're all doing. Yeah, like the the Dark Haven is is in the lead Remove. of points. Right, but War but... Score, as you see, you know, the twenty one thousand, two thousand, twenty nine hundred. Yeah. Texas, run the move. War score is used to determine the winner, and it's earned, war score is earned by capturing and holding objectives. So, like it, as we just do things, even if we don't uh, retain them, we'll still get credit for them. <laughs> score. Texas at the wall. <laughs> Wolf, where are you? Are you running with the pack already? Yes, you are. I see you up there. So proud of you. All three cats are back so, here just waiting for you. So I, I'm not sure if that answers your question or not, but like the score just goes up over the week and then resets weekly. It's a more a bragging right than anything else. 
Most of your work is individual based weekly with the pips, is what I've been under the impression. Yeah, I can't do this. Yeah, he's not gonna be able to do it down there. Fuck uh, it, I don't care. That we can we can res I didn't die. Nice. He's a thief! Yeah, I took he that reduced falling damage talent. He used his short bow skill. Like you hold forward at the end of a Zelda just to like safety roll from like any height. <laughs> now I just feel like you're a glutton for punishment. I saw you run up there for no reason. <laughs> Why is there a fucking constant wind in my ears? Because this okay. is the windy territory. We had a windfall buff. I think that's oh, okay. the vibe of the fall. It was just like way louder than anything else. Oh, we're trying to take the fours to get the buff on the zone. What is the... Okay, we took this red. zone. Okay. Try when what? you take all of the towers in the center of this specific map, the zone will get like a, a bloodlust effect. So that means Oh, I see. So the more territories you get, the more point the, the more points you get when it like every time it tallies an, another amount of score. Yeah. And it's just and it's just like the the people that just hold the most territories during each of the tallies at the end it gets like a high points and then there's no point in yep. being number 1. Basically. Okay. Except bragging, yeah. And you're, uh, you're right, Wolf Girl, it's, it's totally changed since you probably played. I don't know how long ago it's been since you played Guild Wars 2. I have not ever played World v. World I'm when I played. I'm streaming Wolf, and that was a question, sorry. <laughs> oh, oh, my bad. There's another Wolf. <laughs> There's oh, another right Wolf on. in the channel. <laughs> you're popular. Oh, you're way back there, Wolf. Uh, yeah, I don't, like, were we taking this territory? Do we already take it, or...? We already took it. I don't know what okay. they're doing there. I'm trying to take all the territories. I thought there was a reason they were sticking around. Yeah, I don't know what those people in particular were doing. So really, it's just like, it's kind of about, like, speed? Just about, like, just can you get to the territories over and over and over as fast as possible? With enough people to steamroll the... There we go. Yeah. yeah. So now we've got the Ruined Bloodlust. Because we took the entire mid. And then there's green over there doing like two things. We green almost have the whole map. A whole lot. Well, on this map anyway, they were kicking our butts in the other maps. Oh, okay. Shit. Tapped out for uh, a wrong. Commander disappeared. Uh, he, oh, oh. It's in the map chat. He's uh, moved maps. Oh. Yeah, he went to Sanctum. Okay, I just moved. Oh damn, that's a long time. 2016, bro. <laughs> it has changed. We need to bully a guard for you so you can get a piece of your war claw. Yep, we got Borderlands Bloodlust. There it is. Oh, I'm almost to my... I'm almost to my uh, gift of battle! Making up for the one I fed the cat in PC for a minion. <laughs> Oh, he was buying <laughs> He was buying plans for siege gear. Pretty important. Well, if he did what I have, I have the portable siege thing in my bag, which I forgot about, FYI. So I can buy siege wherever I need to. Are those important? Because I've been throwing them out. Uh, only uh, if you plan to be world v world. Yeah. And only if you plan on like, you know, actually putting the stuff down for people to build because most of the time the commanders will do it for the group they're in. I just don't have the space to hold them. 
I usually mail them off to Wade, so if you get any more, send them to me and I'll, I'll send them off. Okay. No, I didn't, yeah, I've been doing a lot of work. Good job, guys. Am I getting, like, any, like, experience for doing this? Yep. Uh, what's it going towards? Uh, your worldly world, uh, level? No, 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 master no experience. No master experience. Oh, no. You're, when you come in here, you don't get anything mastery-wise other than what's for worldly world. Okay, we use some more of that. I can, I can see why now people are like, this is a pretty good source of karma. Oh yeah, this is karma. It's, it's pretty easy. Up, oh, up, oh, we've got some Giant targets over fight. there. We got some greens. We're going in for a, a skirmish. Like we'll what? What? Why? Does. Why wouldn't they just be running away? They are. Oh, it's those guys that bullied us earlier. I really want to kill them. There was a guard here. You should have probably killed it. I did. I shot. I shot the veteran guard. Perfect. It's like this is what we're taking. We're taking this keep. Yeah, he's got superior stuff. Uh, legendaries have changed, uh, they are now account bound, so if you get one on one tune, you now have them for all your tunes. So you only have to make one Twilight, or actually technically, if you make an Eternity, you get all three weapons. On your entire account for all your characters that can use swords. So I'd recommend if you have Twilight and Sunrise that you combine them into Eternity, and then it unlocks Eternity and everything. Oh yeah, there's a ram right here that if you have supplies, you can probably pump it into. Yeah, exactly. No more grinding for it. It also unlocks all the skins for all the versions of it because now you can craft your legendaries and not rely on the drop rate for precursors anymore. You can still get precursors for legendaries, but you can now craft your precursors. But it's all through a mastery track that you have to do, so you'll need to have all of the uh, expansions. Mounts are from Path of Fire, so the expansion before the current one that just came out. We are currently in the newest expansion, which is End of Dragons. Which added a new mount. <laughs> Supply down here, if you've used yours, Wolf, is... There's probably a little bit left you can take from this camp now. This is the supply unit. I can't carry anymore. Okay, that means you're your max capacity. Yeah, so 10 is how much I can hold by default. Well, the thing is, you can hold up to 20, but that supply cache in general only has a low supply cache, so it'll only give you 10. Oh, it caps you out at 10. Uh huh. If you if that supply cache was upgraded through you know the constant defending of the keep and whatnot, then it you goes up to 20 or 25. Well, 25 if you have the mastery tracks. Correct. What's the point of returning to a keep that you already have besides getting supplies? Supplying. He's resupplying because he uh, built rams. Yeah, see, this oh, okay. gives me 15. I don't know about you. Yeah, I, I just got it to 15. Yeah. So you get the supplies to build the vehicles to take the keeps? Mm -hmm. Is there so any other use for supplies? 
Yeah, supplies is to rebuild walls and stuff like that. There's a guard here, so you'll want to kill yep. it. There's also, like, so if you look up above, there's defending things as well. There's not just attacking vehicles and stuff. There's, like, arrow things you can build. All the trebuchets you can fire gravel at people, which do damage. You can drop burning oil on people. <laughs> well, that catapult got built so fucking fast. Didn't even take any of my supply. Yeah, basically, that's what we're doing. We found a, a commander tag that's actually, like, doing things, so it, it's a fun zerg, that's for sure. Oh, we got greens behind us. Green is running. Yeah, he didn't get more. Nice, defend it. Is tier five participation the max you can do? Tier six. Okay. We got an uwu claim, an old school one. I'm so excited. Thank you for claiming that. that people well, you it. may have to upgrade that because I think five is what I max out at. Uh, no. Okay. You don't. You don't have to upgrade it yourself. You just have to level up. It looks like because I'm level 88, 89 now. Well, there's birthday cake here. Oh, yum yum. I'm gonna eat some of this cake that's on the ground. Hey, look, we'll fight something on the ground again. <laughs> See, we're, uh, we're hitting the wall for the, the keep from this far away. That's what superior catapults give you. Obsidian shards! Gimme, gimme, gimme! Wall's at 51%. I like these ones that are shooting the catapults have a little bit of a off aim. <laughs> okay, so the amount of pips that you get is based on your world's current rank and your, your current world v world rank. It's a combination of those two values. Correct. So there is a reason to want to be in first because you get rewards faster. Yeah. Alright, I'm going. Oh, I'm yep. leading the charge. Commander's not going. <laughs> Get your help. What are you talking about? keeps you need a pretty good big team to fight this guy actually his health pool grows with however many people are in your team oh. you can take it with three people he hurts 
There's a key. Oh, thank you so much! Thank you so much for uh, giving Huggle! Oh, daily completion, nice! Look at this! So pretty! Look at this! So pretty! Oh, I don't want to fall in the water. I don't want to fall in the water. Okay, I'm good. Let's wait for a wolf. I don't... I got kind of left behind because I couldn't jump into the keep, so I had to, like... Okay, we're right here. There's just okay. a veteran shark in the water. Just watch out for it. Oh, look! You can glide now! Congrats! Yeah. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't have that, and I couldn't get on the land, so everybody went in the keep, and I just kind of swam in the water for a bit, and I didn't know where to go. Oh, yeah, it's to the left. Yep. Okay, I'm I'm so proud of you. You earned your wings. He wants to engage this hill. Yeah. That's the next key. gonna try to take this back? It's got timer on it. Trying to get my speed boost for him to trigger. Did you get the drop from uh from the no. guard yet? Okay, so no. more guards. Oh. You wanna stay in here so you can get the point. Boom. Your, my moves cost different amounts in World v. World. I'm not used to that. Oh, I gotta hit on that Doliac! Yeah! <laughs> Look at this! So pretty. Look at this! So pretty. I love my Silvari. <laughs> Looks like a super monk. Let's see the colors. <laughs> oh, already running good. Going to the Green Lake Tower next. Welcome, welcome, whoever's joining to watch. We are worldly worlding. Wolf's first time here. Uh, Wolf, this is my secret to all of my level 80s. Uh, all of the leveling books I get from here. 
Ah, uh, you get the books and then you give them to your alts. Hell yeah, this is a boost a tune of place. <laughs> I already have enough to boost another tune to 80 from running these. That one's got a shield generator up in there. So since uh, he's changed his mind, we're gonna build him up on the ledge here. Yeah, we're gonna build the catapults up here on the vantage point. Sometimes I feel like commanders just like to run in circles to see if people will follow them, just for shits and giggles. He's like a dog looking for a spot to poop. <laughs> you're, not, you're not wrong! That's a green tiger there, you know? Name He-Man? That's a fat tiger. <laughs> Name Cringer? Trying to remember if the distance of his catapults will reach from here. At on max, him. I think. Right? Right, honestly, if he's gonna do that, I'd put a trebuchet down. Well, he's got the superior wood, so yeah, that'll reach. It was a green dude. Oh, he's gonna die. Oh, I wouldn't run that way! Come back! I'm coming back. Woo! That's a lot of them! Run, bitch, run! That guy gonna die. Yeah, I am. Oh! <laughs> hey, it's that bully team. Should we not be, like, taking this base that we're right next to so that we can, like, that's what they're of... Those bases are not. Those are. Those are the ones that gives you the boost, so you have to control them all at the same time. So if any one of them gets flipped, you lose it. It's not. It's not plausible for the most part. Oh, okay. I don't know if it's hitting the wall. Is it hitting the wall? Yeah, it's hitting the wall. It's at 60%. I'm so spread out. This is bad. You can get that anymore, uh, Wolfric. How do you, how do you build? Uh, well, if it's all like build what, like this, the. the I don't know. The guy just said build if you have the supply, and I don't, I don't, I don't well, know how you build. Well, he's already built it, so. They're already built, yeah. Oh, so you need like a. What do you need to build though? Like a plan? No, the, he ha he has to have the plan to like lay it down, and then you have to be right next to it. To use supplies oh to feed to it. it yeah okay so like if you look at it how it is now um that's when it's complete and when you can dump supplies into it it'll have you know uh scaffolding and shit all around it oh, behind it's going for, yeah minus
Get fucked, nerd! <laughs> Try. I, I, I can see when you're trying to go for a fucking a, a sneaky back door. I've played. Uh, He's played the. the what the fuck's that? That forty man battleground in WoW. When you get the when you get the glaives and you go dock so that you can get the glaives oh, and then you can. Oh, I hate that one. That I, shit. But like, I'm so fucking hyper vigilant on backdooring siege weapons that like that's what I'm used to. Oh, now there's a green <laughs> choke point. Oh, there's a green behind us again. Trats Wolf, you rabbited him. <laughs> you bunny bitch. <laughs> Oh shit, they're, they're counter trebucheting. They're trebucheting us. From the keep? From the keep. Uh, Doc incoming, or one incoming. Two incoming. On mounts. They're all, they're all coming in. Yeah, they're all like running in. There's their gang right now. Shit. Mm. Return to a waypoint, and there's no waypoints. There's one. There's no one waypoint. Glory, it's contested. It's in it's contested. Oh, 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 am I gonna oh, get it? Get 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 oh, shit! So now that I died, I have to run You're all the way back to no, the No, you took my we're unicorn! <laughs> my unicorn power, bitches! I'm pretty sure we're getting wiped. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's a steamroll! Okay. Yeah, I got steamrolled. <laughs> nice. Oh, look at all those corpses! <laughs> What's the difference between the two timers on the participation? Like, one is like trophy <laughs> track points, and one is. You can on redo the it the second time around to get different rewards, I think. But, like, why are there two timers? Oh, the top timer and the bottom timer? Yeah. So, like the, the one, top one timer the is decreasing very slowly to remove how many pips or what tier you are at, like, gaining rewards. So if you look above it, it has like mine's currently 195, you know, trophies. Yeah, yeah. So every single time the timer next to that trophy ticks, the rewards below that goes up by however much that Wolf, is. Wolves are moving out. Okay, and what is the, the what is the the one on the bar mean? The one above, like the tier, or whatever. Tier six, eight minutes and 48 seconds. So that's decreasing and telling you how much time you have before that bar decreases fully. Oh, so it'll go from six to five, five to four, or whatever. It, yep. It, it if you sit there and don't do anything for a while, it'll turn to red, and that timer then tells you how long you have until the bar just fully goes down to zero. That's so, what I was right. talking about by pipping out. So when you're done with World of World, sit and let that time out because you'll get rewards still, even if you're not doing anything. Get the max amount of pips that you can from what you built up. You need supply up? Oh. I, Go. I forgot yeah. to supply at the start. I don't even know when I spent my supplies, but I have two. Well, you can get ten from here. The, uh, the supply that was near the teleporter, that's the one that gives you, like, the, the 20s. We should have oh, resupplied back then, but I can... Oh, I had go. two when I died, maybe? Probably. Probably. We're going through this one, or are you going to go around there? I have no idea. The, it, the gate looks the closed, so I was going to go to the right. Well, because there's a red door for us right here. Yeah, oh, okay. Just run through it. It's like a teleport. Resupply, too. Oh, I can't carry anymore in this
Uh, Wolfric, you can uh, come do World for World with us if you wanted to. Champion's demise. What? All right. There's a yak that's spawned. He's got a timer, doesn't he? He's got two minutes, so just go far. I go long. Oh god! Why did it shoot my cat's butt? Is there a way to like if you have a if you have a ground marker and it's... Oh shit. You guys hurry if you guys can. We're trying to take it from blue. Blue's already up there in the keep. Ah, we're gonna kill blues. No, like blue's already taking it over. No, they got it. Damn. Never mind. No, nope, they're all dead. <laughs> well we can still kill these uh you wanna kill the guards, you can't run through that one. Kill this guard. Yeah, it's kind of hard. There's some loot. Did you get it from that? Get what? Your warp claw item. How will I know if I got it or not? Like, I don't... Like, is, does it get... Is it a chest or, like, what? Just an item that should drop in your bag. Oh, no. I don't think so. I think it might be a sentry, not a guard. It says, unlock Warclaw tail armor by looting it from guards, is all it oh, says. God. Oh, then it's just a random drop from guards. And you have to actually pick it up then, I think. Oh, we're gonna oh get shit! Uh, just die. The commander went back to the whatever thing. I choose my own death! No! I got away. But to what fucking... <laughs> well, we can teleport back to the main teleport now. In southwest? Yeah, I think that's where the commander is. Yep, that's right. Yeah, border waypoint. raid chat or the squad chat it says call it like it is it's smut <laughs> i love reading this chat commander disappeared i think he's calling it i think he said he's done or he's going mm -hmm. somewhere else did he go to the border waypoint we're at the border waypoint I think he just he went to tarnish coast yeah he went to the tarnish coast one So Citadel Waypoint, yeah? Correct. He's here. Are you where I am? Oh, sorry. You guys aren't in that right one. Tarnished Coast border. We are in the Tarnished Dark, Coast. Sorry. Dark Haven Alpine. Oh, Jesus. Wrong map. <laughs> oh, we're jumping again, Wolf. <laughs> Pop, pop. 
Get ready to go. Oh, he's a. You know, with you running in front of me like this, a little bit almost feels like you're being chased by my cat. You're like, fuck off! <laughs> All he needs is like a whip. <laughs> Fake port. Sorry, team. <laughs> see, this is something you can build now. See? I'm gonna pull that guard for you. Oh, the fact that it's got scaffolding around it? Yeah. Hold on, I'm gonna ask the commander first before I trigger it. Oh, no, they already triggered it, so I'm gonna pull the guard away for you. Fucking triggered. You said. Did you get it? Will it just let me know if I did? Because if yeah. so, I'm no. It'll be something in your inventory. Like a physical object. Oh, there's a bag of loot on the ground right now. Oh, pick it up, pick it up, that might be it. Mm, nope, I'm just white right at him. Oh, this place has levers. <laughs> this is when I need to be on Yzma. Is 195 the highest you can um, get to, or point increases? Uh, for your level? Uh, for the Mist War. Yes, I believe that's the highest you can get unless you like spec into it. Okay. Oh, I knew it. Guys are in the Tarnish Coast uh, Discord server because apparently we're being uh, being followed by that green pack. Oh, this is like fucking spy versus spy. Almost, yeah. They, they sit in the Discord to gain fucking counter intel. Yep. Fucking MMO <laughs> players are like fucking scourge. <laughs> it's not E levels though. Oh shit, we missed that camp. This is actually a really decent commander for these maps. Wait, you get, you get materials by just messing with these things? Mm-hmm. Yep. Oh, I've just been ignoring them. I usually would pick them up, but I have been ignoring them lately because especially when you have an active commander like this, you don't want to get left behind. So sure. the resources are not worth it. Yeah, yeah, I can understand that. I'm going to pep out because I need to go to bed. So. Okay, thank you for coming, Texas.
Are we yeah. going? I'll be here, but I'm just gonna pip out. Pip out! Well, um... Is that a Pokemon? Yeah. I was about to say is, before you... Um, once up. you hit... <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say is, once you pipped out, uh... We could pip out. You need to go help Wolf with his champion. Champion! Oh, whatever. But I, w I would like to try to take this peep with him one more time. Like I said, it's very rare to have a good active commander. Do you remember that one that just ran us in circles text that one night? Oh my god. Yep. There was a char commander that he just kept running in a circle, not taking anything, and people were following him like idiots. I'm like, okay. All char must die. <laughs> Truly a brilliant commander. I didn't mean to use it. I thought I was helping. My bad. No, you can use it. But if someone else has a higher catapult uh, mastery, they'll kick you out of your seat. If they want to use it, because they'll give more power. Yeah, that makes sense. See, someone has started using the arrow carts that are a part of this uh, tower to try to hit us. Balls at 23%. Hello, hello, everyone's joined. We are currently World Be Worlding. Wolf's learning about the World Be Worlds and the loots you can get from it. You're using the term learning very loosely, aren't you? Yep. No problem. <laughs> There's a green right there. Kill these guards. Don't go too far in. He's bombing the wall from out here still. See, there's a green up there shooting a, a cannon at us. A couple of greens are here. You think, I, you think I can't dodge your cannon, bitch? If I was dead eye, I could probably hit it, but... Oh shit, we got one out here with us! That fucking ranger. Oh, it's that whole damn team! <laughs> oh no! Our academy pole! Yeah, we're not capturing this one. <laughs> no! Hi, wolf! Where you going? Or we're respect the camp? Well, wait, wait to see if maybe we might win the. Oh, never mind. We got zerged. So, this is a perfect way for us to like go back to the camp and pip out, and then we can go take care of your champion. Okay. That, the uh, greens have found us. So what that means is, like, go back to the main camp, and you literally just hang out until your bar hits zero. Uh, so if you have loot in your bag, which it's time to the 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 main bar, so I have to wait nine minutes. Okay. You can sort your loot because you can. You have a trading post and everything here. Oh, Maybe I see. Maybe a little see. more than nine minutes, but yeah. Oh, I see. The 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 participation it, it must update as you're actively doing things. So it goes back to ten minutes right. or whatever, over and over and over again, and then you, and then you can let it flush to zero when you're not. Correct. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah, All right. even the commander said there's a lot of games. Let's go through my loot bag right now while we're waiting for a minute here. So, in terms of, like, the other things that I need to get, it says to use a war claw helm. Oh, that's the track. Uh, unlock the body armor by purchasing it with skirmish claim tickets from the war claw vendor. Where is the war claw vendor? Right here. This one with the blue one. Right here. Attack my target. Oh, I fucking don't have I even roll enough tickets. But I do have enough for the leg armor. Let's buy the leg armor. Easy. Daily daily spender? Yeah, there's dailies in World of the World. 
You have a daily to spend 25 badges. Okay. Now, if you have gotten any of these trunks in your bag, the skirmish chests, Wolf? Uh, I have two of them. So those, when you open those, they give you tickets, and they also give you, if you look when you click on them, there's the Testimonies of Jade Heroics. Those are the tokens you need that allow you to buy the hero points from around the world. So if there's a hero point on a map that you haven't done yet, you can purchase a scroll that like unlocks those points, and that's what you can do to unlock your other specs. Oh, well, wouldn't I just go do the hero point? Or is it like, you mean if it's impossible to solo? It's random. You don't know which hero point it'll give you. It's just it, if you need the points to unlock your other specialization, this is a way to do it. It's just a oh, way okay. so that if you don't want to go explore and unlock them one by one, you can just like spam those and get a whole bunch of them all at once. Okay, so you. It's random. So basically, you can come in here, just do like world v world shit, and then just like unlock it. I, I don't know. I, I'd rather do the exploring one personally right but once you've done the exploring on one tune hypothetically like say if you the other tune you were playing with nuki or your guardian if you wanted to unlock its specializations without doing the exploring again you can do it this route mm, okay okay i mean i, I get it the other otherwise, thing too is sorry blueprints i'm just looking otherwise what am i going to spend these things on like uh whatever you want from there a blue a blueprint a world v world tactic what is that I don't know anymore. I opened my chest. <laughs> I can't see the list. <laughs> uh... Canned food? What do you use canned food for? That seems like the badge of honor might be the most useful got thing. I got my gift of battle. Yeah, buddy. Oh, what do I want to activate now? Just uh, do the gift of battle again because it gets me more clovers and stuff. I just need to do a map complete now and I will be able to make my juggernaut. Unlock Specker Duder is over. Uh, these guys. It's this guy right here. A uh, hero challenge. Challenge is right here. You are not near me at all. Other hut over here. Look for the black silvari over here. This one right here. Yeah, buddy. Who the fuck are you talking to? Husband. He was lost. Oh, okay. Over here, just right here. Look <laughs> over here. Yeah, that doesn't tell me any. Look right here, just right over here. <laughs> Turn around to the left. <laughs> And a choice of wait, flax, coffee, rest. Are these are recipes? Are any of these recipes worth like garbage? 
I mean, you can account bound learn them. Yeah, I guess so. I'll just pick fucking two of them. My emblem of Avenger can go towards the legendary backpack or armor, I think, for World of the World. Uh, while we're waiting for the pip outs, uh, Wolf, can you tell us what, what type of champion you need us to kill when we're done with this? Oh, it's over in the, uh, it's over in the Metrica province. I don't, I don't know ty like what type. I don't know what type. Is it a bounty? No. <laughs> Question mark. <laughs> I have no idea what it is then. I, 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 I don't know what it is either. I just know that I had to get a key. And I got the key. And then I got to go kill a champion. A key. A key. Before I forget, should I go look up how to do it? So much of this shit. Just throw it on the ground. This might be easy. I have no idea. I just didn't try it because it was a fucking annoying. It was really annoying to make the key. <laughs> I didn't want to do it twice. When are these fucking living worlds ever gonna go on sale? That's a good question. a lot of green in the map. I've hit I've hit a lag spike. Not letting me sell my shit. Oh my god that freaked me out. It's like who the fuck's attacking me in my home base? It was just a thief running next to me. What the hell? From the reward track. Where's the reward track? That's the one we told oh, you. Oh you have to do the whole track to basically get it. Okay. Alright. Understood. Well I mean I got just shy of 4,000. That's not too bad. If you open up your uh, daily chest, you'll get reward track potions that you can... Um... Daily chest. Yes, I did. And I, and I used them. Yeah, without any bonuses to the EXP you get in here, it'll take about 8 hours of world worlding to fill up the bar. Yeah, that's, that's whatever. Get it over time. I was mainly interested in just finishing the story, but I, I don't want to buy the Living Worlds at full price. And it's like I was I was hoping that they were gonna have some kind of like anniversary sale where they go on sale, but I have no idea. Uh, when the uh, next event comes out, they might. Which should be coming up here in August. Oh, I see what I see what uh, Tex was saying about the red bar extra. It's gonna be more time. Yeah, that's the full time for it to fully decay once it's red. So it'll start decaying through all the tiers. Oh, it, so it's gonna take 13 minutes to go from six to one. Correct. And then as it goes from six to one, that 195 will will slowly decrease. Correct. I wish there was a way to flush out. And just be like, just claim. And go back to zero by pushing a button. That would be a smart thing. 
like seventy five percent or something like that. You can just push a button any at any time, and it just it'll just it'll it'll go for it'll, it'll just it'll math it. out it'll just yeah. yeah math it out how much you would get. Just make sure you're running around like you're doing it so it doesn't boot you out. Like happened to my husband last night in the middle of his pipping out. Oh yeah, no, I'm just jumping around. Oh, it's so hard. I want to use these points I have, but I gotta sit on them because I need 20 points for the next one I want. <laughs> I'm at 13. Ah, I was so close to level 92. Damn. Here I'm getting all excited with getting close to like even level 100 in World of the World and Wade's at like 1400. <laughs> level 1400 for him. Yeah. All he does is live in World v. World. If you see him out in the open world, there's something wrong. <laughs> Ooh, motherfuckers like to play one game and one game only. Well, like, that's cool. You do you. <laughs> oh, I love it. He's so good at World v. World. Say, so you'd be glad to have those people when you're just when you want to do World v. World. Yep. Usually, when I go into World v. World, I'll text and be like, "World v. World night? Yes, yes." <laughs> <laughs> Where am I on? What? How far did I get? Oh snap! I'm gonna get the third reward of my bronze chest. <laughs> Damn. In second, Dark Haven is really hot tonight. Shit, look at them on the leaderboards. Yeah, I was, I was like, they're like way ahead. I think Dark Haven was the server that I selected when I uh, made this account as my like worldly world Damn. not that it like will matter right because aren't they just like just randomizing or something right now it really doesn't matter no I mean like in like when they when they do that flip over aren't they gonna make like servers irrelevant I, don't. I mean yes and so, I don't know how so it's what gonna it, work I'm wondering like is like are they just gonna like, assign you a random color no, it'd be by guild. So like your guild will have the flag as a world v world guild. And then guilds are paired up into, you know, worlds in the sense. That's gonna be awkward mm. as fuck. It's the the help of pop. So everyone's like actually populated. Yeah, unfortunately when you only divide it by pop, you're gonna get fucking lambasted on some world v world events where all of the good players got put on one team just to balance. And you're probably going to have, like, one color get, like, destroy the other two color. Right, but then Sometimes. they can balance those guilds is the idea. Right, the first couple is going to suck. That's what I mean. If you don't have some kind of external system, like an MMR-style thing where it balances the right. player or the guild, it just goes to the population, you're going to have the um, crystalline conflict issue where it just throws five players on a team. Oh, look, they're they're all diamond. But unfortunately, some of those are really good players, and some of them are garbage. Right. We. Which button does something? You? Yeah. Look at this. <laughs> I got this in the fucking I, I, I went crazy in the uh, uh, Living World season one And I did like all the Achievements <laughs> and shit like that and like one you of them the You got the tonic didn't you Yeah like you had to go like crazy and do all these Like 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 tunnels and shit And get keys or something Shit and then it gave me this tonic 
Did you do the jumping puzzle in the dry top? I, I, I've done every fucking achievement in dry top and silver waste. Every single one. Oh my god. <laughs> I was like, this fucking place is nerds. fucking cool. This place is cool. I did it without a, uh, I did it without a glider and without a fucking mount. I did them too without a glider and a mount when those came out. Those Some were of the them shits were fucking, uh, scary. Some of those yeah. jumps that you had to do, like, over over chasms and from, like, post to post and shit. With the, the broken-ass crystals. Those shit were fucking hella scary, like, 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 fucking nuts would be in your throat. <gasps> <laughs> like, every, every fucking jump you'd make. I have six minutes and I pep out. Same. And then I bought... What the hell did I buy? I bought a tonic of something for a hundred laurels. Oh, which <laughs> one like, did you the get? The cat or the dog? I don't know. I just... The, the one that was 100 laurels. So I think it turns you into a cat, yeah. It could be. There, there's, there's two other ones for 70, and I'm saving up to get those. The minions? Yeah, or yeah. I don't know, I'm just like, I figure, you know, fucking buy everything, right? Because you can only buy it once. Well, the laurels, you'll need them if you want to make uh, Ascended Armor. <laughs> yeah, no, no, sure. But they're not the only way to get things, I assume, right? Well, they're the only way to get the patterns. Craft them. Oh, patterns. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I don't even have a crafter capable of fucking making them. I'm not, I'm not even, like... Getting that last 50 points on every crafter costs, like, an arm and a leg. Well, I can like offer every... you an arm if you want a level one. It's fine. I got, like, I got Huntsman up to, like, 470. But buying those, like, every, every craft is, like, five gold. Every single individual craft. And it's like, ugh. Oh, my God. <laughs> Sorry. What? <laughs> so Scrooge McDuck here. It's funny. Uh, I only have like 150 gold, so that's like five you have gold. More is than like... most newbies. <laughs> I'm yeah, just but, saying. Uh... I'm just saying. All right, I just pipped out. Mm. We have four minutes. What's your timer on uh on things though? Uh, nice. I will get I will get one more participation reward if I stay. Gotcha. That's what I, was I, I see what you're saying. Yeah, if if the timer's not going to match that, there's no point in staying. Unfortunately, I got 425 and 432, so I'll get a reward. There you go. You'll get 25 points. <laughs> <laughs> 95. <laughs> You're not going to get 95, you're going to get 25. Because that bar is going to go down to tier 2 and tier 1 before the 4 minutes is up. <laughs> I think one time when I was trying to pip out... I went and like hit a moa or something like that and it triggered it as activity because the area was contested. I was like, shit. <laughs> when you're doing um, fractals, do you have to do them in order to unlock them? Like one, then two, uh, then three. Yes. You can't just go from one to like twenty. I believe yes. Other you have people, to do if if you're if you're hosting, does that skip to that person, or do they still have to unlock theirs? So if you are the leader and you're the one hosting the fractals, you have to go one to twenty. But if I'm hosting the fractal and I took you with me, we could go right into twenty. Yeah, no, I I get that. What I'm asking is, does that count for me for 1 through 19 if I run your 20 as their host? Or do I still have to go 1 to 19? I don't know. I don't know. I've never tested it. Okay. 
I mean, I, I like I like having to go through each of them. It reminds me of uh, Assault back in Final Fantasy XI. Fuck it. 25 points is stupid. I'm out of here. <laughs> How do I leave? You have to go through the Lion's Arch gate. The gate up here that says Lion's Arch. He's the one. Or you can teleport to the guild hall and then teleport out back to your original spot. Yeah, you can do that too. Cool. Well, thank you. So go to the champion where you need to be. Okay. Uh... Here, I think. Is there, like, an easy way to get, like, a large chunk of, like, experience really quickly, but you're limited by, like, day or week? Anniversary. <laughs> what is that? I don't, like, do you get a lot of experience every, on your anniversary? So, every year on your character's birthday, you know, a year from when you created that character... So, like, the first anniversary, you'll receive a thing that auto-boosts something up to level 20. And then every year after that, you'll get another one that goes even further beyond that. So, like, year two, you'll get oh. one up to level 30. I'm sorry, I don't mean character experience. I meant, like, mastery experience. Uh, okay. Uh, buying the... <laughs> <laughs> you need to get a raptor. Oh, yeah? But to, like, jump around or something? No, because you can get uh, pet treats that you feed your raptor and it gives you mastery experience. And it's a big chunk of it. Only uh, for Central Tyria masteries. But, yeah. but it's still... Oh, I, I'm masteries. already maxed out on Central Tyria. I, I was mainly thinking, like, is there an easy... Other than running around and doing fucking stupid fates constantly for minuscule experience, is there a way to, like... Like, a daily chunk that gives you a lot of mastery for, like, one zone. That's what I'm trying or to say. Or something like that. The, the pet treats give you a good chunk, and it's not for Central Tyria. It's for, uh, Path of Fire ones. Oh, Path of Fire, yeah. Okay. Because, like, I want to upgrade my gliding, but, man, it's like, okay, goddamn, it's just a huge amount of experience constantly. And then I, I, like, and I would go and, like, level another tune, but all of that central criteria and my central criteria is fucking completely capped. So, for the Heart of Thorns ones, you have to do the events in the maps for Heart of Thorns to level those out. That's a fucking pain, but that's what you have to do. I assume that there's some kind of, I like, know what champion you're talking about now. Yeah, yeah, it's this one. The one that goes down in here that you open the key with, right? Yep, yeah, yep, yep, yep. Well, okay, hold on, what time is Fire Elemental? No, no, I already got it. No. What I'm like telling I you is Fire Elemental, usually they do this event during Fire Elemental so you get double the XP, double the fun. What do you mean double XP? Like the XP for Fire Elemental simultaneously? Yeah. Oh, but if you've already done Fire Elemental for the day, it doesn't matter. And plus the thing's not going to come up for like three hours. Yeah, but yeah. I know which champion's not that hard. We can do it. Okay, okay. Yes, I just need both the boys here. Um, yeah, no, I was just, I was just hoping for some like, like date, like daily login reward esque thing that gives like a large chunk of experience, so I wouldn't have to just like constantly do it. Oh, anyway, my question was going to be, uh, is there some kind of like Reba esque, like Heart of Thorns Zerg, like forty man party that goes on? Where they just run around and do fates for experience or something like that or anything like that? No, it's in the Tangle Depths. Any, anywhere, just any Heart of Thorns experience. I can put one of those together in a heartbeat for you if you want. But yes, you can Zerg those. 
I just want to like I just want to like join what other people are doing, and then like and the byproduct of that would be getting experience. <laughs> Texas, 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 I was going to show you this before you go to sleep this time. With the, the fat, cute cat. Hold on. Oh, my God. <laughs> so, so damn cute. Did you see it? Oh, my God, I love it. I hear an Asura choking to death over here. <laughs> They're all choking to death. Look at the area. Oops. You're gonna get like cyber cancer by just walking into the area. <laughs> oh my god, I gotta do it again. Is it off cooldown? It's so fat and cute! Oh my god! <laughs> Oh, I love the I love the chain bomb for that. <laughs> you see, Tex? Yes, I saw it. I'm sorry, it's so cute. I can't help myself. I just want to squeeze it. So cute. <laughs> Okay, I think. Are you here, husband? Good. He's uh, making his way over. He's here. Okay. Um, all right. Uh, interact. Override. Leave. So let me just go in. Yep. Yeah, this thing. I think I gotta like. What the fuck do I have to do? Like, is it over here? No, you just click on the thing in the middle. No, there's like there's there's I a push the ultimate. Button. Oh, you have to oh, do something? I might have to, yeah, but I, it might have to be after you kill this guy. He's not gonna, like, knock me off, is he? He can! He can. Okay, cool, and then what do I do here? <laughs> this thing? This thing, no. This thing. This thing, got it. Okay, thank you. That's all I need to do. I had to touch that thing. Uh, what, what's this do? I've got I got hyper uber cancer by jumping through there. <laughs> all right, thank you so much. Well, I'm headed off. Have a good night. night guys. Have a good night. Night. All right, now I gotta go build this bullshit. What are you building? Uh, I'm building Maudry. <gasps> yes. I was like, I was like, I was, I, I, I apparently had like cooking and huntsman and all this shit leveled up, so I make my own food really easy. And I made all of phase one, and I, and I need like one more thing to make all of phase two. Oh my god, Madri is uh, an ascended back I just, piece. Yeah, I, I just wanted to get it the fuck out of my inventory because it takes up like 19 slots worth of garbage they dump on you when you do the story. And I was like, okay, I got the clay pot. Well, now I gotta go to. I gotta go to the Mystic Ford. So. Let's figure this shit out. Uh, Foxfire Cluster. Have you gone to the Char Zone yet to do those those challenges for it? Uh, no. Oh man. I was doing that, and then I was leveling my cooking, and I was doing all the cooking stuff, and then I got to a point where I don't remember why I stopped. It needed some crazy amount of material or something like that, and I was like, sick, but no. Did you get those materials? Uh, I got some of them. I right, wanna... Let's try this. While you're doing that, I want to figure out how to unlock my other legendary skin. All I need to make Juggernaut now is I need another map complete. I actually need to finish exploring on one of my characters. Alright, Clay Pot got next.
cultivated seed plus pot. Got it. Package of laid dusted plant food. Uh, now nah, I made a bunch of that shit. Oh. Okay, I need to get my thick leather sections. I beg your pardon. Leather, it's like fucking beef jerky, but you don't need it. Thick leather section 200. I'm gonna go see about unlocking my Aureen thing real quick. Because apparently once you have an Aureen legendary, it can unlock the other two that are out now, and I don't haven't gotten any letter or any bullshit, so I'm back to our cave. See if that does it. Okay, cultivated shoot. And now I need the grow lamp. Which I fucking don't have. Do Bingo! Have? There's my letter! Levias, a discovery surrounding the Aurene based weapons. Dear Commander, I have discovered an astounding property surrounding the Aurene based weapons you carry. Similar to Aurin, they can absorb Elder Dragon magic, but the difference is that they change their form. Come speak with me at the Aurin's Enclave in Setsung Province or at the Exchange in Ash um, Arborstone, and we can get started on exploring what they can do. You'll need a flawless Elder Dragon scale to start, and I have a few I can part with in exchange for some resources. Nice. Oh, I remember the grow lamp fucking is hellaciously hard to make. What do you need for it? I still have leftovers. Well, I, I gotta I gotta go farm uh, dry top because I need the I need to make charge quartz crystals and you can only make them once a day. Oh yeah, I remember that. And now. then and then you need like 250 of them, and I well, you don't just have buy that the grow many. lamp. Yeah, but it's like fucking 30 gold. Like, if I had a way to offset the cost of me just buying fucking anything willy-nilly, I would do it. But I don't make money. Like, if I was actively running high-level fractals and selling mats, I would just do it. But I have no... My income is... Sometimes I get two gold a day from daily. So it's like... I, I would be at zero money if I just bought everything. you shoot me if I bought you a grow lamp? No, please don't buy me one. I, 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 I'm, I'm rather enjoying <laughs> this as a, as a, uh, a okay. slow burn project. Because, you know, you're sitting there saying if I did this and this is like, I found my way of making money, but okay. <laughs> yeah, no, it's, it's cool. No, but th thank you for the offer, but no, it's fine. Plus, I got all of phase three to go through. That just freed up like three inventory slots, so good deal. One thing I don't like about this game is that it's impossible to target certain cooking items. Like which ones are you after? Like any, like like certain, just certain things. They're like, uh, cause I'll, I'll Google like on the wiki how to get 
like how to get ghost peppers or something like that. And they're like, oh, it comes from random fucking uh, nodes that have a chance to drop one of 25 different things. There's no like ghost pepper node that you can go farm. There is. It, like in the wild or whatever. Uh, maybe that's a bad example, but there are tons of, uh, of things like that. Like when I Google like acquis uh, acquisition, how to get how to get them, it's like oh, it drops from winterized vegetable nodes or whatever, and it's like I could go out and farm it, but it would, but it's like you know pulling a slot machine. <laughs> it's like oh nope, yeah you got radishes, <laughs> womp womp. <laughs> Like for for some food, you can buy it from like vendors for karma, and I like I really like that. But then for other ones, it's like there's no there's no specific acquisition. It's all just like open it and you get it in a pile of chess or a pile of cooking ingredients. It's all randomized. Oh, cool little fish. Poopers. I could buy one of these skills, but I need to know what it entails other. <laughs> oh, what? That's all it takes and I can unlock both of them? Hell yeah. Dude, this looks cool. God, that thing's fucking disgusting. The <laughs> Zaitan... <laughs> I'm sorry, it's so gross. Well, Zaitan, what do you expect? I There's an know. undead dragon. Ugh. Do you see this wolf? No. Oh, uh, does it, yeah, I, I've I've seen the preview of those on um, YouTube. Oh, okay. <gasps> and it leaves like these like gray and yellow like footprint ash bullshit forge a moth one is not too bad that one doesn't look too scary <laughs> yeah I agree arcane <laughs> The trail's kind of cool. So does this just unlock the skin and I can still keep my orine look? I'm trying to figure that out because I don't want to... <laughs> I don't want to lose my orine. <laughs> oh right, the third chapter did come out for this. I'll do that eventually. can sell things to the trading post for pure jade. Usually that shit's just vendored because there's so much of it. Unlocks just the skin. I think I might just you know, unlock it. I may all never use it, but it's just like didn't hear that's like how, that's how it is for literally ninety five percent of the things in this game. I was like, I will never use this to ever glamour, but I want to collect it just to have it collected. Oh fuck! I only have one hundred eighty five spirit shards. I'd have to farm out my spirit shards. Or I can just use 
little chunk of ancient uh, ambergus from all my fishing. Oh my god, I love map chat in Guild Wars 2 so much. Someone like, asks a question and someone then respond with, well, thanks for no help. And then someone says, welcome to Guild Wars 2. And they're like, actually, usually I got, I get lots of help. And they're like, yikes, and you cry the one time you don't? Sheesh. And they're like, no worries, it's late. And like, sarcasm is an art, truly. And the frogs are art snobs tonight. <laughs> It's just like two passive aggressive dudes on the internet just fucking like <laughs> fucking trying to trying to one up each other. Just fucking go go get a milkshake for fuck's sake. <laughs> Do something. But I love reading map chat sometimes. It's like oh my god. My fucking inventory is I, this is what it feels like to be tissy. It's just fucking abysmal. I don't know what to keep or throw out. <laughs> Now I understand. I understand what you have to do for these other skins. Um. Yeah, I get it. I get it. I need to have four splinters to create a, a fragment. Then I have to purify it. Yep. Well, that's okay. Now I understand. Says, Is there know, like what? Uh, no, no, nothing. I was just thinking out loud. Now I get it. 
I didn't think I, I should have known it wouldn't have been that easy. This is an MMO that you're meant to grind everything out. How much do you have? Uh, 158. Like, three digits? No, 158k. Okay. I need 350. Sounds like you can piss it away pretty easily. <laughs> yes, you can! to finish Juggernaut is the fucking map completion, so I have to finish exploring on an alt. Damn it, I've made too many legendaries! What do you do with, like, um, exotic, like, accessories? Do you just, like, do you just fucking salvage them? Yeah, if you're not gonna use them. If you don't okay. plan to have any alts or anything like that to use them on, then just wreck them. Yeah, I mean, there's like there's like a handful of set accessories that are that are good for thief, and none of these are that. Yeah, if you can't sell it, wreck it. Okay. It feels kind of shitty because like I like I got some of these to do like achievements, and it feels like a waste. But I don't know what to do with them. Are they ascended or are they exotic? No, 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 no. They're they're not ascended. Ascended. They're exotic. Yeah. Okay. Just fucking trash them. And even if you get ascended ones, if they don't have the stats you need, they're great for breaking down for materials for things you can craft. I heard you want to, like... I mean... Oh, wait a minute. No, wait. I'm, I have to get this thought out, but I'm like... There are multiple different ways that you can get... You, you can break them down, right? Like, can't you, like, break them down from, like, a new thing with, like, writs or something like that? And everyone's doing that, where it's like, oh, you need to break down Ascended Gear because it takes, like, 10,000 of these new points to make something. Oh, yeah, for the Jade stuff, but you're not in End of Dragons yet, so I would just sit on them. Well, yeah, I don't have any Ascended to, 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 to break down yet, but, I mean, like, like some people salvage them because you can get materials that you can only get for sa from salvaging. Is that a thing, too? Like, like Dark Matter or whatever it is? Right. Things like that. I just don't know what what the most like optimal way to break down or to, to dispose of my shit gear is really. Cause I'm sitting on like, I mean not just like ascended shit, but like I've got like almost two thousand green pieces of unidentified gear. I don't know what the fuck to do with those. Sell them. Sell just sell the whole stack at two fifty. Yep, sell those. It looks like my warrior is the one that has the highest map complete for me to get done the fastest. Cause she's at 60%, Maleficent's at 39%. Everything else is at 1, 3, and 7%. This one's at 18. 1%, 9%, 4%, 3%, 1%, 5%. Oh, well, that one's already maxed out. Uh, 43% on Silva. Uh, um, yeah, these are fucking... Oh, 23% on Vanellope. Damn. 14, 1, 5. Shit, the one that we made is only a 5% map complete. Damn. B 12. Zero, zero. She has not left her home city. 
Uh, 26% on her. 33%. Okay, found another one. 10, 3, 3, 1, 3, 1, 3, 0, and 1. So, yeah. Warrior it is. Trying to figure out what the next tune to do the Tyria map shit. Yeah, so I can get the thing to make Juggernaut because it's only missing. What's my what's my hunter at? Mm, the hunter's at twenty, but he's only level thirty nine. You usually only take my warrior into World v World. <laughs> Let's see here, what maps does she have left? She's got all the shit areas left to do. <laughs> well, I don't even have to do the. I don't have to do silver waste. It doesn't count as Tyria. I mean, it does. And nope. It doesn't. Oh good, all the dumbass ones are done. Makes me happy. Oh, that one is not done. Ugh, none done in Lonar's Pass. I'm already dreading my life. Because I usually only just went to the bosses with these tunes and then... That's all I did was the world bosses on them. I didn't need to have the map completed if I could just get to the world boss. I'm waiting for, um, I'm waiting for the Living World Season 3 to go on sale so that I can do that and Heart of Fire and get my mount, and then that's when I'll probably end up doing the next, like, leveling my my Ranger, because, man, I don't know. It's fun, fun, it's, it, I've ex fully explored the world, like, almost fully, like, on two characters, and it's fun, don't get me wrong, like, the first time, but, like, now I'm on the third time, I'm like, ugh, I just want to fucking get through it. <laughs> Yeah, that, that's why I have two at 100, and then the rest are fiddly doo -dahs. <laughs> Yep. It would be really fucking cool if they, if you could like do it again on your same character, like you could just like reset your progress or something. Oh hell no, I would never do that. <laughs> well, no, it would be the, it would be the same, same thing as doing on a brand new character. Just like reset your world and go through it again. That because I don't know, just the, the, it's. It's just an odd concept to me that you're only ever allowed to earn two on one character and permanently. Well, forever. Because they want to encourage you to play alts is what it is. Yeah. They also encourage, you know, if you're going to make a legendary having someone craft it for you. Because if someone else earned those maps, you just have to give them the materials that are tradable and then they can craft it for you. Because the yeah. generation one legendaries are tradable. Seems kind of pay to win to me. Uh, welcome to Guild Wars. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just saying. But still, you're having fun with it, even though it's a pay to win. Yeah, uh, I'm. I'm more about the journey. Like I won't. I. I like. I just. Oh my god, my know. minion is defying all concepts of gravity. I love the mounts in this game. They're so much fucking fun. Have you done all of the achievements for all of the, like, the living world shit? No, I have to do those still to get the legendary pendant. I meant like I, season like I meant like like one and two. Well, I've done the initial ones, yes, but I haven't done every single achievement inside them. But I need to go back and do the return version of it now, uh, to get the legendary pendant. 
that makes you redo all of them again. Return. I remember seeing that somewhere. Turn. My friend Fizzy is currently playing, so let's go raid him real quick. I oh yeah, I've got all, all the returns. The You've done all the returns? Uh, no, just just the of the of the ones that I have. Like I don't have I don't have the other living worlds. I've done re I've done all all the achievements for Return to Maguma, Dragon's Reach, Echoes of the Past, etc. Like all the ones that I've got. Damn, like I still gotta do those. Like I was, like I, I did all the content that I have, and I was waiting to move on, but I was waiting for sales. <laughs> I was mainly, I was not talking about the returns. I was mainly talking about the story journals. Oh no, I've got like achievements here and there. Oh okay. Great fizzy. Thanks everyone who came out to watch us play uh, Guild Wars, it was lots of fun!